My name is Lee Chakwan Elban and my SID is 53076805. And the topic I'm going to discuss today is how should we ease the several income disparity problem in Hong Kong. As everyone knows, Hong Kong is a rich city whose economy is one of the most vibrant, free and competitive in the whole world. There are many rich people in Hong Kong. In fact, the richest man in Asia, Li ka Sheng, is also a Hong Kong citizen. Hong Kong also has any other billionaires as well. Our property prices is in fact one of the highest in the world, and many people couldn't afford one, despite working for hard for their whole lives. However, despite all those achievements and signs of being rich, Hong Kong is also the city which boasts the largest income gap in Asia. In the PowerPoint, you can see the difference between the poor and the rich in Hong Kong. Hong Kong has the highest Gini coefficient in Asia, according to the United Nations, and more than a million of the Hong Kong citizens are currently under the poverty line defined by the internationally. Can Hong Kong really call itself an international financial center, proudly despite of this tragic situation? For a city as rich as Hong Kong, it's both shocking and saddening for such tragedy to happen. But what could we do to ease this problem? To improve the situation, I hereby propose five possible solutions that could help reduce the income gap between the rich people and the poor people in Hong Kong. My first proposed solution would be taxing more heavily on the rich people and they had as they could live well, well despite paying more tax and the tax could be used on helping the poor people. My second proposed solution is to offer more financial assistance to directly help the poor people's income. The third proposed solution would be creating more jobs for the impoverished people in Hong Kong so they can have a stable income to support their living causes. My fourth proposed solution would be providing more education opportunities for young people so to have a better chance to find a job with a higher income in the future. And my five proposed solution would be to provide better social welfare, such as public housing and free hospital services for the Hong Kong people, especially the poor, so they could their living expenses would be lessened and they would thus have more income left to fend for themselves. Which solution do you think is the best? This is the end of my video. Thank you for watching.